Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So I'm continuing the Naked Gun series. This is the Naked Gun two and a half, The Smell of Fear. <laughs> the fact that it's called two and a half is already funny because it would just normally be the second one, but I don't know what the half stands for, so I guess we'll see. <laughs> so I recently watched the first one, I did a solo reaction for that one, and then I watched Airplane with Anthony, and that was such a fun time. These movies have been so fun, and I've been really enjoying them. I've just been really loving the style of comedy lately, it's made me want to go watch a ton of other 80s movies, specifically 80s comedies, but just 80s movies in general. Yeah, I just been having a good time. So I can't wait to laugh a bunch probably in this one and see <laughs> where they take us in this one. Wow, the whole cast is in this one again. <laughs> Even down to OJ Simpson. So this is supposed to be George Bush Sr. Oh. Oh. <laughs> he's just he's walking right with him. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Getting worse and worse <laughs> already. <laughs> oh. Yeah, in, in all honesty, the last two I backed over with my car. Well, you've never been a good driver, so there's that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and from the nuclear industry, kaboom. <laughs> choose the right path. The president has appointed as. Dang, that's a big lobster. In this area, Dr. Albert S. <laughs> I feel like lobster was a poor choice of food for this. While people are talking. <laughs> this field is without fear, and Dr. Meinheimer will present his recommendations. <laughs> the claw! The oh, no! oh no! Oh <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, well aware of Dr. Meinheimer's reputation, so I think that perhaps uh, he's best qualified to explain his research. Oh, it's gonna hit somebody, isn't it? Oh! Barbara Bush again. <laughs> hey, the opening again. Two and a half. A matador. Where are we inside? Are we about to get birthed? This looks like a birth canal. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah, we got birds. Oh gosh. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah, I forgot at the end he like, um, at the end of the last one, he said some hurtful things to her. And you're here late. Now surely a lovely young woman like you can think of something better to do on a Saturday night. He was in, he was the dad in Harry Potter, wasn't he? I forgot his name. Jane, Jane, look, you, you mustn't be so hard on yourself. You've done a wonderful job here at the at the Institute. You're, you're the finest director of public relations we've ever had. Wow, she changed careers really fast. Look at this. Found this in the wastebasket. Hey. Why are we being so Are's casual? Oh, it's not a clock. Oh, no. Woman's too slow. Oh, no. Oh, goodness. Oh my gosh! <laughs> wow. I was on my way to advise the DC police as part of the president's operation. So, is she okay? 
Or are they gonna see each other again this way? This is a Oh my gosh! Oh, this one's a real mess. Oh. Hey, everybody, over here, Frank found another one. Do you have you missed this? Any witnesses, oh, Ed? Oh, just one. A woman. Oh, it's Priscilla Presley, which I forgot her name in the movie. Oh, I'd better do it while it's still fresh. What, not now. They're gonna see each other again. Dead away. She took a nasty knock on the head. She looks pretty bad. I'll handle it. Sir. Excuse me, miss. I'd like to ask you a few questions. No. Oh. <laughs> Like she was your mother, for Christ's sake. <laughs> well, he was. I know this is awkward, but you're not still obsessed with our relationship, are you? Obsessed? Who's obsessed? Because she backed out on the wedding two years ago. I'd forgotten all about it. No! Oh, she backed on the out. She backed out on the wedding two years ago. Hello, Jane. Dr. Meinheimer. A uh, Frank. This is Dr. Albert Meinheimer. Don't get up. Nice to meet you. Likewise, I'm sure. But I believe we might <laughs> Yeah, I'll just saw each other. Anything can help. Yes, I, I gave the sketch artist a description. <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, and I'd like to see the rest of the institute now, if you don't mind, Dr. Meinheimer. Yeah, why, of course, we should start with the research <laughs> area. That's a good idea. <gasps> Dang, he drew her all those... Oh, wow! What creature was that? There are hundreds of experiments going on, all temperature controlled by the machinery just below us. Many of our scientists have spent years... Oh, no! ...just now making major breakthroughs. And today, we're going to join together two compounds that have never been forming together. Oh! Oh, no! Are you in some way connected with the Institute? Well, not officially, but as a matter of fact, Jane and I have been seeing quite a lot of... Ooh, people. he's gonna get jealous! I just noticed the pictures in the background, <laughs> like the Titanic. Oh, they have, oh my gosh, all the things they have. <laughs> Dang. I mean, the strongest thing you got. <laughs> second thought, how about a black Russian? Oh gosh, it's, is it gonna be an actual black Russian? Oh. Oh, was that like a no to the camera? <laughs> like, no, we're not doing that one. Ed, is it just my imagination? Or is <laughs> That's the black Russian? Small percentage of the population. It has a shrimp. I'll see you in the morning. Oh, 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 that was a close one. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> well, this is not easy to say. I, I feel like he's at the wrong table. Someone to hold to love. Frank. No, yeah, he was at the wrong table. Play our song. What's their song? Of course. so far in this movie. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still laughing. Okay, back to the movie. Oh, I feel like I missed this whole conversation because I was just like, and the way he sang it too. <laughs> okay, I need to calm down. Oh. A certain kitten still knows how to scratch. <laughs> oh, where'd that hand come from? <laughs> then I had it slashed and burned so we could build a dream house. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Insensitive. You think it's easy displacing an entire tribe? 
You try. No. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I don't have this much sex as a boy scout later. What? Oh, no. I a time I was dating a lot. <laughs> Gosh, let's hope that's what you meant. <laughs> oh no. Insulate as well as ten sheets of glass. An electric car, partially powered by solar panels. <laughs> the girl, <laughs> like the price is right. Dr. Meinheimer will deliver his speech. It is my view, for now we must rely on coal, oil, and nuclear energy. What? Wait, what? What is happening? What are we clone or does he have a twin? But uh, you gentlemen don't have any choice. What? Who are you? Do you? What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> The boot, right? Is that what that's called? I've never had one. I figured if I buried Is he driving backwards? Oh, what? How are you driving backwards? Oh, there he goes, hitting every car known to man. I'm booked on Geraldo next week. You're going on Geraldo because of this? No, my wife is a transsexual Satan worshiper. What? <laughs> I didn't expect that. I remember this, fuck. Ex-boxer. His real name was Joey Chicago. Oh, yeah. He fought under the name of Kid Minneapolis. Hey, I saw <laughs> him fight once in Cincinnati. Hey, those are, those are some good stage names. Like Tex Colorado. You know, the Arizona <gasps> South. Tex Colorado? Dakota. Why is that such a cool name? North or South. North. South Dakota was his brother from West Virginia. <laughs> South Dakota. <laughs> The address we were given for Monique DiCarlo was in a part of town known as Little Italy. We proceeded there, hoping this could be the lead that would bring us to Hickory. <laughs> in the background, the Coliseum. <laughs> oh. He's not working alone. Let's bug the van, see where he goes. Good thinking, Frank. Nordberg? No problem. Is he going to be an actual bug? Oh. Decent people in this town. Oh, hi, Frank. Say, we got that model D83 Swedish sugar <sighs> truck machine in that you ordered. Oh! <laughs> you come here often, I guess. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, they went from concrete to that. Goldberg's <laughs> bugging devices right at the money. Oh no, Nordberg, no! You're gonna end up in the hospital again. Oh no. Oh no. I guess it's not the first high speed police chase he's ever been in, right? Oh, oh, now the bus. He's going to Detroit. How you doing, Tripper? Oh my gosh, no! And they're eating from a food truck. Oh no! <laughs> well, Savage might have died. No, <laughs> Davy Crockett. Come on out, then throw down your guns. No. <laughs> Oh, he survived. Wow, you're really demanding a lot. What? Now he went to the zoo? 
well, they all got out. It's like in that movie Madagascar. Remember the Madagascar movie? <laughs> Oh, hello. A baboon. Oh, Nordberg's still on the bus. Thank you. Excuse Yes? He did what? How many animals escaped? He's always getting into trouble. Do you realize that because of you, this city is being overrun by baboons? So, isn't that the fault of the voters? No! <laughs> May I get in? No! I'm going to call my underwear in January. Frank, what's that He's a kind, gentle, concerned man who cares about people. You know, Priscilla Presley's a really good actress. I'd never seen her act before The Last Naked Gun, but she's really good. I just hope your pal Clinton is watching right now, because I know he's uh -oh. a jealous man. Always oh, oh my gosh! <gasps> They're going into a dance number! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure that's not Priscilla Presley <laughs> or Leslie Nielsen. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dang. I recall seeing your name on the guest list. Nothing to be embarrassed about. I sometimes go by my maiden name. <laughs> I feel like that should have been as funny to me as it was, but it was <laughs> hilarious. My order out. <laughs> Relatable. Quesada. You never know what you're gonna get. You <laughs> Quesada. Oh, that's not French. <laughs> okay, light reaction. Sorry. Ladies and gentlemen. Time for the first door prize of the evening. An all expense paid trip to the Gilligan Islands. <laughs> Gilligan Islands? Oh. Oh no! Ah! Oh no, you shorted out of stuff! Oh no! Oh, oh it's getting worse again! Oh my gosh! <laughs> This is like the Queen incident all over again. <laughs> and it keeps going too. <laughs> it still keeps going. Oh, oh, okay, all right. Oh, oh no, it still keeps going. How is your chair capable of that? Oh, oh. <laughs> like E.T.? I always thought these like kind of city New York style apartment houses, what do you call them? New York apartment, are they houses? I don't know. I always thought they were super cool. Townhomes? <laughs> His giant bouquet. Weren't they supposed to be in DC originally? How are they in New York now? And she has pigs. <laughs> uh oh, Savage. Well, you're gonna have one flower by the time you get there. Oh. Dang, she fed a whole thing of milk. Sorry about what happened tonight. Frank. Jane, I need to talk to you. May I come in? Well. Okay, but the place is kind of a mess. And I was just about ready to make a <laughs> It's all stems. Yes, it's going to endorse energy efficiency and renewable energy like solar power. Who else knew that? Only me. And of course I mentioned it to Quentin. Damn, <laughs> that's a deep fridge. Efficiency and solar energy. <laughs> Who would be the biggest loser? Well, coal. Oh! <laughs> 
It's like the wardrobe in the in Narnia. To Narnia. Strange, but he has been under a lot of stress lately. <laughs> I'm just laughing at the colors. A tattoo, web toes, a third nostril. <laughs> hey, that's a protein shake. What are you trying to tell me? That Quentin has somehow found an exact double for Dr. Meinheimer? He's a clone. That double will give a fraudulent <laughs> report to the president? Why, that's brilliant. That's a lot better than what I could do. <laughs> what more do you want from me? I use your phone? Local call? Yes. Excuse me. Take my shower. The phone is in the other room. You can let yourself out. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> <gasps> Don't hurt the pig, Savage. <laughs> How many clothes did you? Okay, but he's gotta like miss or something, you know? He's putting the silencer on, but something's gonna mess up. What is it, the song of your childhood or something? No, oh, he's singing! Of the smiles we left behind. You ignited the love of music in him. Can it be that it was all so simple <laughs> and or has time rewritten it? Oh, oh my gosh! I don't know why I screamed with her, sorry, I don't know. <laughs> oh, oh! Well, you couldn't see it before because of the full body condom, so, you know. <laughs> <laughs> the toothbrush. Ah, he's brushing your teeth for good dental health. <laughs> he's blow drying you. <laughs> it was just a towel. <gasps> you hurt the pig. How dare you? What is he dead? What happened? You could literally pull it out, but oh no, he's gonna blow up! Huh? Uh oh, pull it out, dude! What the heck? Oh my gosh! Uh <laughs> oh, I was so frightened. Ah! What happened out there? It's nothing, nothing to worry about. But if I were you, I wouldn't leave until they've had a chance to shampoo the carpets. Oh. <laughs> I want to kill you, Frank. Before tonight, only the cable company. <laughs> now I'm afraid it's one of Habsburg's goons. The Habsburg's. The Habsburg's jaw. Z. I promised Nordberg we'd bake a raisin nut bread tonight. Why didn't you walk? Are y'all back together? Finally? Is this Unchained Melody? I love this song. Oh, they're making pottery again. Or did they ever do that before? No, they ran on the beach before. <laughs> I forgot all the activities they did. <laughs> oh, whoa. Whoa. Hell, <laughs> it got in your mouth. <laughs> Hey, what happened to protection? What happened to the protection? 
<laughs> that is not you, Leslie Nielsen. <laughs> Condom scene one, but that was that was good. That was good. Poor hunch. You mark my words, that that Hotsburg is up to something right up to his pretty important shirt collar. Check. Ready, Frank? Oh! Did you hit the dog? He hit the dog. Oh. He hit the deck. Okay, no, that was stupid. Sorry. And that's why here at Hexagon's Tanker Captain Training School, future captains go through a rigorous instruction. <laughs> <laughs> why does that look fun? I want to drive that boat. Ew! Gross! Why did that remind me of the Halle Berry Catwoman? <laughs> you know the pipe where she comes out of? I love that movie. I don't care. I don't care what anybody says. Halle Berry's my cow. <laughs> we kind of think of it as our friendly neighbor. But remember, our friend can't exist without huge government subsidy. <laughs> oh my gosh. <gasps> what are the dogs doing? Oh, they're just sleeping? Okay. <gasps> oh no! No! Oh, he doesn't know what's going on. That dog is what my pug wishes he could be. <laughs> oh no! The sewer. <laughs> oh. oh no. Oh no. I love it. No? It's <clears throat> wired. <laughs> the real Meinheimer. You've met her old hacker. The fake Meinheimer. The Redmonds. The Redmonds? Oh. Okay. Hello, the Redmonds. A bat. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what else is going to fall off of that? Baseballs. Reference to the first one. Pull. Oh, ow! Those are heavy, too. Oh, <laughs> horseshoe! How are you not unconscious right now? <laughs> oh! Oh, no! Pa 
snacking peanuts to top it all off. An oh. anvil? Oh. <laughs> Just you and me. Oh. Mono a mono. And teach you to pick on a helpless invalid. <gasps> oh! Party's inside. Quentin, I was just getting a breath of fresh air. <laughs> Ew. Ladies and gentlemen, the national thousand points of light, light, thousand points light. Recession, bad recovery. <laughs> They want an encore. <laughs> A key? Oh! <laughs> the Chicago Bears? Oh, there you go. Oh no, he's still going forward. Oh no. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, he can walk. <laughs> oh no. No. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, drop the sander. <laughs> no, no. There is a fraud in this room, but it's this man. They got him. Oh, oh, whoa. No, no, no. That man, Quentin Hapsburg. <gasps> and he's not here. Oh, dang! <laughs> They're right next to each other! <laughs> dang, he came prepared! Uh, <laughs> like when they die right before they tell you. Uh, <laughs> has plan B in. <laughs> has plan B in. in. Oh no, is he gonna die too? Then we're gonna have to go to the next. If that's your attitude, forget it. <laughs> Cause he's gonna die anyway. <laughs> But it's not going to work this time. You're part of a dying breed, Hapsburg. Like people who can name all 50 states. <laughs> oh, that. Not so fast. Ah! Nightburn! OJ! Oh. Oh. A mouse? Six I'm New Year's in Times Square. 
Thanks a lot. Uh, there goes Quentin. Oh, wait. Oh, he lived. Somehow, some way. Dang. You got lucky there. Oh, the lion! It all came back around from the zoo. I promise you, if we ever come out of this alive, I'll never let my police work interfere with their love again. Watch them break up in the next one or something. I know there's one more. <laughs> Everybody's asleep. <laughs> he has a sleeping mask. <laughs> what? Whoa, what is that position? Now, to elaborate on point 102. Here, read this. It's an emergency. What? <gasps> Stroking the love muffin? 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 <laughs> Walk, single file. That's it. Now, if we just stay calm, no one's going to be harmed by the huge bomb that's going to explode any minute. Uh oh, 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 no. Hey, I got my sleeve. Just take off your jet. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's like so close. What are they going to do? Uh, oh, oh, he unplugged it. Oh, it could be unplugged this whole time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh. Now, I want you to head up a new Federal Bureau of Police Squad. Oh, he's gonna be a Fed? In the next movie, he's gonna be a Fed? I've learned something this past week about the Earth. And about love. I guess love is like the ozone layer. <laughs> the ozone. Blowing away a fleeing suspect with my 44 Magnum used to be everything to me. I enjoyed it. Well. But now you found love. But now, I want to be known as the environmental police, police lieutenant. <laughs> Swim in the ocean. And go into a 7-Eleven without an interpreter. <laughs> what? Oh, I want to learn. Where I can wake up each morning with this woman whom I love. Uh, <laughs> no! Barbara Bush! Whoa! Are you going to say yes this time and actually do it? <laughs> him behind. Uh. Oh, it's funny. Oh no, it's always Barbara Bush. Oh, oh. Uh oh. <laughs> That's the end. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see if there's something in the credits. I think I missed the credits last time, so we'll see. All right, so that was the Naked Gun two and a half. Still pretty funny. I will say, though, I don't think it was as good as the first one. It's It had its funny moments. Something about the first one just had me laughing, like, the entirety of the time. This one did have its moments, though, but I just still think that the first one was just better overall. But, you know, it was still fun to go back into this world, back into this universe, see Frank again, see Jane again. And now, looking towards the third one, I'm assuming he's going to be, like, a federal agent of some sort because of his promotion here. That's going to be interesting. So, in the first one, we had the whole plot line with the Queen. And in the second one, we had the whole plot line with Meinheimer. I feel like the moments between Priscilla Presley and Leslie Nielsen are some of the best in these movies. Um, like, they had another great scene together here that was so funny. Um, and then also, I feel like my favorite joke, and this is so random, was when she was like, play our song, and it, <laughs> and it was from The Wizard of Oz. <laughs> It was so dumb, but it was so hilarious, and that was my favorite joke from the whole movie. <laughs> well, I'm definitely looking forward to the third one. I'm going to be watching it on the channel, so make sure you're subscribed. Check out our reaction to Airplane if you haven't seen it already, or my reaction to The First Naked Gun if you haven't seen that yet, and I will see you next time.